you can never have too many scrunchies. I love scrunchies, and if you don't love them, well, you're silly. No, no, just kidding. No, you are. No, silly. <laughs> no, I love scrunchies, seriously. I just, I think they're really nice. Um, I, I know it's kind of maybe cheesy or whatever, but I just, I really like them. Greetings and salutations, my name is Orkult and welcome to my sanctuary. To those of you new here, you're very very welcome, I hope you like this video, stick around and watch some of my other videos, and if you're a returning subscriber, thank you so so much for your support, and welcome to yet another video. So what we'll be doing today is I'm gonna show you some of the jewelry that I've got recently. Uh, some of it was thrifted, which was freaking awesome, because I've been after some of this stuff for ages. And some of it was from like really mainstream stores, which kind of freaked me out. Some amazing stuff. I was so thrilled. So I'm going to share that with you now. So starting with what I got, the first thing I got when we got to Moscow was on this site called Avito, which is kind of like a, in New Zealand, we had a trade me, which was like an auction site where people sell secondhand stuff and some businesses sell things. And, you know, you can pick up some furniture nobody wants for free kind of stuff and I love sites like that I just love them I sold so much stuff here so far I've been buying but I have put up a few auctions as well so I'm hoping to sell a bit more things that we're going through at the moment but the first thing I saw and I was just so amazed because it's a Killstar vintage ring that I've been after for a while I have seen it before I think once and I was hesitating because I wasn't sure of the size or something and then it's a giant, giant thing, and I just wasn't sure if I could pull it off. And while I was thinking, somebody grabbed it. I was like, damn it. And then they realized I didn't want it, but it was too late. But here I saw it, and there it is. The ginormous Killstar pentagram ring. Like, you can't really get this anywhere anymore. And look at that detail. Yeah, there, there, I finally got it to focus. I mean, how freaking cool. It's it's massive. It's absolutely massive. Look how big it is. It's like half my hand. And it's absolutely amazing. And it's quite heavy as well. But the detail in it is stunning. It's before, you know, all the people complain a lot about the Killstar quality, which is probably true. But this was, you know, before. So the quality on this thing is sensational. And I just absolutely love how big it is. And I've seen it on a few people, and I just wanted it ever since, although I don't really like to cover myself in pentagrams a lot, but sometimes when it's really beautiful, and I do have another pentagram ring for, again, that reason, another Killstar one, which I got because I couldn't get my hands on this one, which is much smaller, but also quite beautiful. Um, but I, I, I was stoked to get this, really stoked. So that was the first thing I got. Another thing I got in a brand I could never really get in New Zealand. I mean, you can get it secondhand, and I think you can probably order it from the UK. Uh, but yeah, it's Disturbia. So I got this absolutely gorgeous. I thought this was much smaller as well, but look how big it is. That skull, I thought it was going to be tiny, but it's quite big. It's a really, really cool necklace with the skull there. And it's... Let me just take my hair away a little bit so you can see how big it actually is. It's really beautiful and it has these different sort of size chains on it. Quite unique. I haven't quite seen anything like this. And yeah, I, I really, really like it. And look at the details on the skull there. Really nice. Really nice. I was quite stoked to find this as well. I've actually stocked up a little bit on Disturbia and I'll have another sort of clothes and accessories haul that I've picked up on the same website and you'll see like how beautiful some of the Disturbia stuff is. I mean, I've heard the quality is quite good, but when I saw this, I was quite astonished. It's quite beautiful. So yeah, I got that one. And now on to stuff that's new, but I got on pretty much, you know those kind of like, they're called different things in different I guess, country, so sometimes they're called Diva, or in New Zealand, Australia, it's called Levisa, and you have all these sort of fairly cheap accessories just hang around, and you can get, you know, five for 12 bucks or whatever kind of place. Here it's called Lady, and oh my god, I was just 
astonished. For one, I bought this, which I was just amazed to find there. So I haven't taken the film off it, that's why it looks a little bit weird. But yeah, it says Freak. And it's just a mainstream store. Like, look how cool it is. It's laser cut and everything. And yeah, quite the new sort of new goth, I would say. Then I got, and this is now one of my favorite accessories ever, is this beautiful, beautiful necklace with black cherries and matching earrings for it. Because it is so freaking easy to put on. You don't have to, especially when I had nails, as in fake nails, I couldn't put on a necklace, like seriously. I could even, this I can even do if I had fake nails. Look how cool it is. It's really, really cute, and it looks better, obviously, on something contrasting. And it has the most adorable matching earrings. Very cute. Very cute. I love them. So that's a really cute set. And the other thing I got was these little earrings here, which are just little spiky ones. I really like them as well. I was quite stoked. There's quite a few really cool things that I've got from there. And there's also really quite a few things that were left. I also got this baby here. Like, it's it's not a crown crown. It's just a thing to put my hair back when doing makeup, which I already forgot to use when doing makeup today. But I thought this was quite cool as well, because all of my things are still in transit. But that that is really cool, so I quite like it. And I got these little hair ties. One is very like beetle juicy, kind of stripey. I love that. And one is just normal black, but you can never have too many scrunchies. I love scrunchies. And if you don't love them, well, oh, you're silly. No, no, just kidding. No, you are. No, silly. <laughs> no, I love scrunchies, seriously. I just, I think they're really nice. I, I know it's kind of maybe cheesy or whatever, but I just, I really like them. So yeah, so that was what I got from that little shop. And then of course, the absolute pinnacle and this is something I've been wanting since we were here last, about two years ago. There's this store called Rock Bunker, which sells amazing, amazing metal things. Like, you can get a t-shirt of just about any band on Earth, probably. And hoodies and t-shirts, they have Cradle of Filth slippers. They're tiny, but they're Cradle of Filth slippers. They have new rocks, they have steel shoes, like, you know, the grindery but with the steel cap kind of shoes. Really nice. But they also have the most amazing collection of old school, old models of alchemy that you can't find anywhere else. Like, I'm serious. Some of these models are so old, you can't find them anywhere at all. And I've been looking at this last time and they had two of them. Like, how can you not, like, how could I not get this? Look at it. It's purple. It has crosses. It's just, it's the most stunning thing ever. I haven't worn this yet, obviously. I, I just got this today. But I've been dreaming about this ever since I saw this last time. For like two years. And finally today I went in and it was still there. In fact, the second one is still there. I just couldn't believe it. I was like, really? Nobody buys this? And they have, like, just about every old alchemy design under the sun. I'll try not to go there very often. It's very dangerous. But, I mean, how could... Like, look at... Look at that, like, the shade of it. It's just beautiful purple kind of lilac. Like, absolutely gorgeous. Absolutely gorgeous. Like, I couldn't resist it at all. Stunning. Very stunning. So that is what I got so far. I hope I will stay away from some of these stores for a while. Because they do have really cool stuff, especially that alchemy. But it's quite a bit away, so it's, it's, I'm not likely to go there by accident. But it's like a museum and they're like, seriously, you walk in and they have this alchemy and you... Uh, uh, I'll stop now. So that was the jewelry haul so far. Like I said, I will try and knock it off and use what I have, but I, I was dreaming of that alchemy for a long time, so that's my excuse. I hope you enjoyed the video. I 
hope you're having a pleasant time of day wherever you are. Um, I welcome everyone, especially returning visitors and subscribers for your support and if you're new here i really hope you like this video stick around and uh, join us in our little club of uh, my sanctuary here so have a pleasant time of the day again and greetings and salutations to you